everybody, ow, and welcome back to another episode here from my Minecraft Survival Let's Play. Ow, how is everybody doing? <laughs> I'm doing so good, thank you all so much for hanging out with me today, and we built this awesome mine in the last episode, and check this out. You guys seem to have loved it, it was so cool to build, and we also have Batman. Um, still around here somewhere. What's up, Batman? <laughs> so cool. Actually, some people said it's just, don't call him Batman, because technically it's just a bat. Uh, we can call him Bat-Bat. Um, but it's okay. It's Batman in our hearts, you know, uh, but it's, it's, uh, AKA, uh, Bat-Bat. <laughs> so, how you guys doing? Bubba's ready to go. Bubba's, are you all right? What are you doing? You're staring into that sex? You want me to go down that way? Are you hungry? Of course she's hungry. Wait, my particles are off. It's okay. Particles fixed for next time. It's almost like she didn't like this meat. It wasn't cooked correctly for her. I didn't see the hearts. <laughs> What's up, Bubbles? But you know what? I asked you guys in the last episode to pick a number from 1 through 10. The majority love number 7. So uh, we're going to go down number 7 here. So that's 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5, 6, and 7. So this is the lucky door. Everyone says that there's going to be a bunch of diamonds waiting for me on the other side. So I'm going to go down this way for um, two stacks of torches worth, okay? Okay. And we're going to go ahead and see if we can collect as many diamonds as possible. One uh, slight snag, though. I only found my Crimson Stealer. I have no idea where my fortune pickaxe is, so I had to make a brand new one. And we got this work pick. Uh, if somebody knows where I have my fortune netherite pickaxe, let me know. Where is it? Help me. I have no idea where it is. But also, uh, we're going to do some cool stuff today. I'm going to see if I can set up. A gold farm. That's right. I'm going to also see if I can get to that roof of that nether. I know a little bit of tips and tricks that we could do. Bubbles knows too, right, girl? She's going to tell me how to do it because I don't know. And maybe we can break uh, a little bedrock in there so we can do some stuff on the roof and make it nice and easy so we don't die uh, making that gold farm. How about that? But first off, I'm going to go down this way. I'm going to see if I can um, get some diamonds. You ready, Bubbles? <laughs> Alright, now this is one of the craziest things I've ever seen in Minecraft, okay? And I've been playing this game for a very long time, so I have to bring you guys into this. Um, this is an underwater mineshaft. An underwater mineshaft. This is crazy, and there's traps, literally traps, like if I'm playing some Indiana Jones movie or something. Oh, look at this! Look at that! Look at that! This is crazy! We're literally all the way underwater right now. There's, like, uh, there's a gravel traps everywhere. This is insane. This is the coolest thing I've ever seen. I don't even know where to go and how to get around here. This is deadly. This is really cool, though. I did find a good amount of diamonds. I'm going to show you guys in a little bit what is the total. I haven't even looked to see, but I just have to come back in here and show you guys. This is insane. What? I think this is it, though. I can't find anywhere else to go. 
Oh, but let's get back. This is already too dangerous. All right, that was a quick trip. It was very adventurous, though. We were able to find a little cave system. I was able to find that mine shaft underwater. That was pretty nuts, but I, I was able to find a good amount of diamonds. I forged three everything already just so we can get some levels because I did end up adding mending to all of my armor bits from the villagers, Professor V and Professor Mendez. So we were, well, just Professor Mendez, not Professor V. Professor V didn't give me nothing. Professor Mendez hooked it up, but let me know what you think. What is the diamond count right now? Put hashtag diamonds. Whoever gets it right, I'm going to give you one diamond, okay? Here we go. Five, four, three, two, one. We got how many diamonds? 30 dot That is not bad. That's a good haul for literally, uh, I only went down for like, I think it was like 15 minutes, but that was awesome. 30 diamonds. Man, whoever picked a uh, number seven, you guys outdid yourself. Now, let me know in the comment section, where should we go next? Maybe in the next episode, we'll go down another number, and the one that gets the most will go down there. <laughs> but that's awesome. Let me go ahead and smell some stuff though, too. And not only that, though, look at all this coal we got. So let's go ahead and line this up down here with some coal. And then add all of our gold and all of our iron down here. That's a good amount, man. It was only like 15 minutes. Pretty cool. But those diamonds, though. All right, Bubbles, that's enough playing with Bat Bat. Let's get out of here. Bat Bat, I'll see you later. It's officially Bat Bat now. <laughs> let's go. All right, now, before we get on into the nether, let's collect some materials and let's get all the proper stuff we're going to need. One, to break bedrock. Two, to set up a portal on the roof. And three, to start construction of our gold farm. Oh, we're going to be gold rich. All right, I think I got everything I need to get to that nether roof. And it should be here. Well, I don't need the golden helmet. I'm just going to replace that just in case. I don't want to get beat up by a piglin, okay? But I'm going to need uh, ladders, some ender pearls, uh, and then to break bedrock, I think I'm going to need some pistons, uh, some obsidian, also some TNT, a lever, and a couple little things along the way. If anything even gets stuck up there, we could just get a portal. Uh, so if you guys are going to try or attempt anything like this, make sure you have enough to make a very basic portal to get out of there. Because I think we might get trapped. Also, I think um, Bubbles went to the nether. Bubbles, you're crazy. Come on, girl. Come on. Bubbles. There she is. Bubbles, you're crazy. What are you even doing over here? What are you staring at? You like that lantern? You're crazy. You better just stay. Okay, you're not going anywhere outside of this room, okay? You stay right there. Ooh, you crazy. But well, you know what? Also, I'm going to take this lodestone uh, compass so I don't get lost. Uh, now, uh, one of the things that we should find... Oh, I don't have a bow and arrow. I forgot my bow and arrow. That's fine. Um, I heard the best place to build a farm... Uh, well, a go farm. Oh, God. Oh, I forgot to replace that. The best place to uh, to make a go farm uh, is in a nether waste. So I believe nether waste are over there. So I think we're pretty good by going that direction. Uh, and take it up. No. Bubbles, get out of here. You're going home. Bubbles, going home. Nope. Get out. Get, get going back home. Go back home. Thank you. Um, let me make sure she's okay. Bubbles, don't you let that piglin take you out of here. Get out. Go. 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 No. No, no, no. Don't go backwards. Pig. Pig person. Get out of the way. Bubbles ain't going. That's final. Stay down here. Wait for me, okay? Definitely not safe in there. And eh, let me just get a crossbow while I'm here. All right, now I'm ready. Bubbles, be good, okay? Take care of the island. I'll be right back. I'll try not to die. I know you ain't coming. It's too dangerous.
easy enough. <laughs> that was so simple. Okay, and then you can tell right there that is a no-no spot. I do not want to build it over there. That is uh, the Basalt Delta. So we got to go here. Uh, I do believe this area right here is the spot, but I marked out this little area right here. So now let's get to work. Let's see if we can go ahead and set this up. Nice little hole over here. Um, wish me luck. That's how you win Minecraft. That is so awesome. It didn't take that long. I thought it was going to take a little bit longer than that, but I feel so bad for Logical Geek Boy and also for Sly Slime over in Legacy. I believe Slice did this for like eight hours straight to dig a big old hole of bedrock. I'm good with just one. So, um, yeah, we're good to go. That's fine. <laughs> but uh, let me go ahead and get some more materials and we'll do our go farm. I believe this part would be the best place to set this up. And it's a really super simple design that I've seen before from Shulker Craft. Uh, see if I can set that up right now. But give me a sec. Oh, man, we're going to be rich. So rich. Hmm. Should we do a hub up here? Nah, I'll keep it downstairs. Cow, you still alive in here? How did that even a thing? Would have sworn this cow would have been dead, eaten, charred to a crisp by now. You lucky cow. Captain Bacon, what's up, my friend? How you doing? It's been a while. Get ready. I'm going to get a bunch of gold for you, but only, um, not today. I just noticed I'm going to need turtle eggs, and I don't have any. You know what? That's fine. I got an idea. And that idea is to build something that I haven't built ever before. Let's build a turtle sanctuary. Oh, baby. Bubbles, good news, bad news. Well, good news, I'm alive. Bad news is I can't build this gold farm. But guess what? Good news is we're going to build a turtle sanctuary. Oh, I know you're excited, but uh, I got to find some turtles. But I think I do know where I can find some. You want to come? some turtles let's go i knew there was some turtles over here perfect beautiful and amazing let's go ahead and land right in here bubba just stay right here you probably want to eat that turtle don't you eat that turtle is there any more i'm gonna need there it is okay there's another one. Oh yes okay let's make it daytime really quick and yeah let's go ahead and make some turtle babies and maybe a little sanctuary over here all right step number one we need some sea ground okay bubbles you can get out now you can get out that's fine you can get out girl that's fine uh okay just ch chill out right there Ooh. You got some of that water in my face, girl. Stay right there. He has the meat. Okay, step number one. We are gonna need uh, some shears and our buzzing materials. I'm ready to build, baby. Uh, let's get some shears here. I'm gonna need a little bit of sea grass right over here. Then let's make a quick little crafting bench. Oh, a little piece of sea grass. Uh, oh, I missed that one. I'll get those now. Now, <laughs> let me go ahead and make uh, just a chest area right here. I brought a bunch of stuff, but I never brought chests. That's great. And there we go. So let's go ahead and see if we find these turtles again. There they are. Oh, so pretty. Come with me my friends come with me get yourself down to this island make some babies this is gonna be amazing come here you sweet oh look at them come 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 you two come we need both of you this is not a, a one-man operation oh you're so cute look at your little turtle babies are gonna be so cute too oh baby let's go right over here get on land right here this will this will do this will be a nice spot excuse me please don't forget what, what you're supposed to do right now thank you come come on down we both of you, come on down. Get on the beach. Get on the beach. Please! Please! 
Come on, Dan. Where are you going? Are you forgetting what you're about to do? Man, they're a little shy. Okay, I understand. You know, this is a, a big step. All right. You know, you just don't become parents uh, overnight like this without a little a bit of a conversation. But you know what? Just come on down. All right. Here we go. This is good. Right here. Come. All right. Don't leave. Please. Please. Please don't go. Please. Thank you. Come on down. Right here. Right here. Just get on the beach. Just in case. Give a little bit of room to breathe. You know, and breathe. <laughs> okay, listen. Here and here. Go. Go. Just do it. Just, just get it over with. Thank you. Oh, you punch each other in the face. Is that how you guys do the thing? <laughs> oh, there you go. Okay. All right. All right. This is cool. Oh, you want me to help? You want me to help? I'm going to get rid of some of this. Another turtle! Where did you come from? All right, hold on. Let's give you a little space to lay some eggs. There they go. Oh, bubbles. Bubbles. Look at that. Bubbles, Bubbles, check this out, girl. Look at it. Oh, <laughs> that's so pretty. Oh, thank you so much. Oh, look at those squid. Okay, is this technically four right here? Is this four? Is this all we need? We do we need to do a sanctuary? I really want to do a sanctuary, though. What do I do now? I guess we just wait, right? Where did the turtle go? I'm not going to be the mother, okay? You better come back. I'm not going to be that mama. Let's see if we can make a couple extra babies. You never know when we need more of those eggs. Come. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Hi. Come with me. Let's make a couple extra eggs. Look. Oh, Bubbles. Uh, t tell that that turtle to stop it right there. Come. Come here, turtle. Come on. Make a little couple more baby bubbles. Get down a little bit. Thank you. Oh, turtle, don't leave. Turtle, don't leave. Turtle, don't leave. Thank you. Can I just push you? I'm just going to push this turtle. It's no big deal. It's not going to hurt. I'm just going to, you know, drag your belly down this thing. Come here. Come here. It's okay. Oh, look at you flapping your little arms. <laughs> no, turtle, don't leave. Come here. Let me introduce you to this turtle. And can you guys name these turtles in the comment section? So far, we got three turtles. Name all three. And do not call them uh, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle uh, turtles, okay? More originality than that. Okay, thank you. Um, okay, make more baby. Bubbles, watching the miracle of life right there. That was the quickest thing I've ever seen. Oh my god, you guys are fast. You had coffee or something? Okay, that's enough. That's enough. I'm, I'm fine. It's okay. Oh, I forgot to have it in my offhand. Um, thank you. Now please make more baby. Please? Please more baby. Turtle, what's up? Hey, that's definitely not your girlfriend or nothing. Okay, everything's fine. These are completely new uh, people. Make more baby? You want to make more? Oh god, you're coming in fast. You're coming in mad. Don't, don't do nothing. I had no idea you guys were uh, uh, an item. But look at me. Don't you dare get, get off bubbles. It's not your same kind. Oh, you're going to say hi to your babies. Oh, look, they're right here. Is this technically four? Okay, that's fine. Okay, I think we're good to go. Now let's start working on a little bit of a sanctuary spot. I think this will be the main area right here. Uh, and I can lure them in uh, and see if I can make like a little bit of a, of a walled off area so they can go in the land and in the water at the same time. And this looks very pretty. All right, let's see what we can do. Oh, when did this happen? More eggs. Oh, very nice. So we got these eggs and these eggs here. Oh, this is lovely. So this is technically like their beach, right? So I think step number one is let's lower this a little bit because they're turtles after all. They can't climb any of this. So let's give this a nice uh, lower to the ground spot. Uh, and then we'll do a little bit of terraforming on the outside, make this look lovely. And then I'm thinking we can make almost like a little bit of, um, of a wooden palisade-like wall that kind of covers up their main area, right? And then on the outside, we could do a little bit of what we did in the pirate uh, island over there. I can't find it. It's over there somewhere. Uh, and we'll do a little bit of stony, um, like sea walls and stuff like that. That'll be nice. Uh, we can make a little bit of a pool area here for them to go in and out. And then maybe... Uh, I'm thinking about maybe cutting this off and maybe doing a little bit of a bridge to get to this section so it could be a little bit cooler looking, right? I think that'll be a lot better, but yeah, let me do a little bit of terraforming and see where we go from here. All right, so far this is looking pretty cool. I'm making this little pond area here for the turtles to hang out, and I have uh, done a little bit of uh, terraforming over here. I did flatten this part out a little more. I went ahead and I separated this bit as well by adding a little bit of uh, just a, a, a separation <laughs> a separation right here. I want to add some slabs and stuff like that of sand stone on the bottom and then we have a, a little fake bridge over here oh i make sure i'm not uh, to stand on those uh, a little bit of a fake bridge over here for now i'm gonna make a uh i think a little bit similar to this but maybe with a curve on it i don't know we'll see the turtles keeps coming up here hanging out saying hi uh but it's looking all right i do oh god i almost stepped on it again uh but i do love this little separation over here i gotta come back on this side and give a little bit of love to it though but i'm working on this one here for now and i'm thinking um we can do a nice little enclosure over here uh maybe with the walls around this end kind of turn it around curve it over here uh and then bring it down this direction 
then on this side I might do oh my god I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna step on that uh, maybe he'll do a little bit of a diagonal gate kind of thing so we can get in and out and go to this island from here and I think that'll be nice I'm gonna be putting some palm trees maybe up here on this side uh, maybe over here on this end we can have a little bit of a step up kind of here from the water area that the turtles can hang out over here and maybe we could do a little bit of an overhang bit uh, maybe like an enclosure so they can stay out of the sun if they wanted to and I think that'll be just nice. So, uh, yeah, let me go ahead and just uh, tinker away over here. Add a little bit more uh, greenery. I'm adding a little bit of coarse dirt as well. And see if we can make this stand out. And then we'll work on the wall around here together. All right, so far, this is looking pretty cool. And I don't think this one has cracked at all. But this one, already you can see, is starting to crack. This is awesome. But, you know what? Um, I think it's a silk touch these, though, right? Because if they're cracking, they're just going to make more turtles. Uh, and I'm needing eggs instead of turtles really we got plenty of turtles right here so yeah i'll just wait a little bit i'll wait a little bit but first let me make a little bit of a wall over here i'm gonna be using a mix of uh spruce a little dark oak and some oak logs here that is looking awesome i think i might also strip some of these and then what i'm gonna do now is i'm gonna add some slabs some fences some trap doors of spruce just lined up here at the top some of these are also gonna have some lighting there so it's gonna you know be nice and lit up uh i'm also gonna be putting some um details here to this pond i think back here we'll do our little structure maybe kind of like exactly where we have this shape of that um that little next elevation we could do almost like a little bit of uh of an enclosure there that can kind of lead out to this little area i think that would be pretty cool but yeah let me just go ahead and just line this up with a bunch of fences and, and extra decorations oh and you know what maybe some barrels in some random spots too some signs oh man i'm inspired let's go all right check this out this is what we got so far so i did this cool little bridge here i kind of like it it looks really nice it's super simple though uh and it's a little bit low down here as well uh, i think i might add a little bit more detail underneath here uh maybe another like a slab or so i don't know we'll see i think i want to improve this part maybe with some upside down stairs down there but we'll, we'll take care of that in a second but uh this is what we got so far so all these details are here i got some signs over here i got some barrels i got some of these stripped i got some of these non-stripped i got a hole right here that's fine Boop. uh this egg is about to pop you know it's ready to go uh and then we got this little elevation that takes us up here i got some lights there on top in certain spots just randomized and then over here i think i might lift these up a little bit have like a little bit of an enclosure here uh maybe uh let's see how about it you know let me take it up a little bit more maybe one more on each and then just uh, for fun, this, how about we do a little bit of uh, arches, a couple arches right here. Maybe just facing down on the bottom here, just to give a nice little, little spot there. And then maybe we could take this up one more, like this, all the way around. I think that will look pretty nice. And then how about we bring in some fences, and right in these gaps, you know what, I might bring some oak fences, just to get a little bit of a change of color there. Uh, but we'll see. And then up here, maybe just some, uh, some slabs. Yeah, oh, that looks pretty cool. Let me get rid of this ugly old thing. Oh, that looks pretty cool. Oh, I like that. Uh, and then maybe we can close some of these off. And then maybe uh, we can have, like, the baby-making process over here kind of, like, separate from the hangout spots over there. <laughs> maybe. I think that'll be nice. I think this is it. Uh, but maybe we can also have, like, a little bit of an overhang here uh, and do a little bit of... Um, like a little campfire action. We are almost good to go. I added a couple palm trees over here, similar to the ones we have over there in the Pirate Island. I think I might even put uh, something up there, maybe like a little seating area or something. I'm making that almost a little bit more private and not really connected to uh, the turtles, but uh, we'll see. I think we could add a couple more things there to make it look cooler. These turtles are ready to go in there. For some reason, these eggs have not cracked at all. These are about to burst any second now. So what I'm gonna do is, let me hit these with this silk touch. And hopefully we get these out. Yes, we got three. And I have a couple more over here. Hopefully they haven't gotten destroyed yet. Uh, oh, that's about to break. I'm going to just take this one. And that's four. That's all we need for our gold farm. And we're good to go. That's awesome. I really never, I didn't even need to build this thing. But it's cool that we did though. But so far I got this little entrance here on the side. Uh, let's wait for that to blow up. This is already filled with water. So I'm thinking about coming in here. I have a couple things I want to add that we could add right now. But I really want to see if I can head back over to our last season's world. I have a bunch of sea pickles over there that I could bring over. Just to add a little bit of light inside here. And maybe even some coral will look pretty cool down here as well. Not too much just a little bit but let's put a little 
bit of seagrass in here just to make it look a little nicer. That looks perfect already. And then over here, we could just add a little bit of bone meal. Uh, I'm thinking about adding some vines in certain spots as well and let that grow a little bit around this area. That'll look pretty cool as well. Uh, getting in some bushes uh, right there, maybe one on that side, maybe one kind of going into the water right there. That looks awesome. Uh, and then maybe another one right there. Uh, and maybe one more right over here in this corner will look pretty good. Yeah, that looks awesome. Maybe a little bit more vine action. And then back here, I want to add some details. I want to add maybe like a little bit of a hay bed down here so they can relax and be all nice uh, in this back corner. That looks really cool. They don't need that, but whatever. Uh, a little bit more vine action back here. Maybe one more right here. Then uh, some more bushes, of course, would look pretty nice. Uh, and maybe some roses as well. Come on, something like that. That looks pretty. Maybe a little bit more back here. That looks cool. I also brought a little bit of lilac action. Maybe we can add that to that corner. Uh, and then maybe one more over here. Yeah, that looks good. A uh, little bit more bush back here will look pretty nice. And I think we nailed this. This is looking really, really nice here. This is gonna take forever. It's fine. We got all the time in the world. Or until the zombies come and start eating those eggs. It's fine. Oh no! I missed the birthing! I missed the birthing! Oh, look how cute! Wait, aren't there supposed to be some scoots or something? Bubbles, have you seen these scoots? Bubbles saw this whole thing happen. Oh, baby. Oh, we're able to get that other um, uh, <laughs> other turtle in here. Uh, but, oh, that is the cutest thing! We got so many turtles. Look how pretty oh, it's a cute thing. That has to be cuter than bees. I'm sorry. Let me know in the comment section. Bees or baby turtles? Or, well, sorry. Baby bees or baby turtles? Which is the cutest? I think. Is this? That is so amazing. Oh, wow. That's so cool. All right, you know what? Get to work. Make more babies, please. This ain't enough. This ain't enough. I want a bunch of these bad boys right there. Uh, that's so awesome. Bubbles, you saw it. Oh, that's so cute. Oh, come here. Grow big and strong, my friends. Oh, this is going to be a little bit overcrowded later on but you know what that's fine we can always expand from here and, and i did end up adding more of these eggs on this side uh that they were making and it's just so so cool i can't wait for them to put some more eggs in here there we go oh bubbles it's happening again come on mama lay those eggs girl there it is oh that is so so cool. You know what I think I might have to add? Maybe a couple more fence gates over here, just in case if any bad guys come this way. Uh, I don't think they're, if there's more fence gates here, I don't think they're able to shoot arrows if they're, you know, like skeletons or anything. Everything is well lit over here, so I don't think they're gonna spawn anywhere around here. Uh, and I think uh, that's that's perfect, that's perfect. Also, let me show you the back over here real fast. I added some more details back here. This is really, really cool. So I added some seagrass down here to make it look a little bit better. And then I added a little umbrella. And then down here, uh, just so you can lay down and have fun right here under the umbrella. Have a nice drink, a little pina colada. Uh, there's a little bit of tiki torches going down and a little boat dock over here. Here, just to add a little bit more details that looks so awesome all right would you like to just come down here and sit and relax while turtles are, are be, making babies uh, and it's uh it's super awesome on the outside here added a little bit of bone meal some kelp there on the side added some bamboo over here who's shooting me are you for real right now who's shooting trident you missing stupid i don't even see you you're invisible oh god you're invisible or something there's nothing in there Get, uh, forget, forget it so all in all, it's pretty safe, but what I need from you guys, I need to know what to build in this island. Put hashtag island. I need to know what to build here because we got the, the sanctuary right there. Should we just add another sanctuary? Should we make this specific to something? Let me know in the comment section. I'm not sure what to do in this island over here right next door. Maybe we can add that for the next one, but I'm thinking right now we're perfectly ready. Right? We are ready right now. Me and Bubbles are going to head off into the nether and we're going to make a farm for gold but no not on this episode for the next one i think it would be a perfect spot to do it what do you guys think right yeah go farm in the next one and maybe we can even expand and do a little bit more of a piglin bartering system right next to cap bacon we can add a couple extra modules because we're gonna need them with all that gold now that we have our turtle eggs we're ready to do some building <laughs> what do you guys think that's awesome but i'm out of here for now thank you all so much for watching thank you for hanging out with me today here while we build this awesome last minute Totally not. I wasn't ready for this, but awesome turtle sanctuary. But before we get out of here, let's do a little bit of a cinematic. And, oh, man, this came out pretty cool for just winging it, right? <laughs> this is awesome. Turtle sanctuary for the win. All right, see you guys on the next one. Bye-bye.